Hi guys, in this video I am going to show you how to fix high CPU usage in Windows 10 and Windows 11. So we have to boost processor and make the computer performance faster. So your system is laggy and not getting better FPS in gaming. This video is for you. Just go to your start menu. Then right click on it and click on run. Then we need to type ms config. Then press ok. Then you will find system configuration where you will have general boot services startup and tools so we have go to boot up section and here you have your current os has installed and look for advanced option so once you click on advanced option you will see boot advanced option and here you will find number of processors so if it is unchecked then do a check mark and click here and here you can click the maximum and then click on ok click on apply and click on ok after that go to your start menu then right click on it and go to task manager now once the task manager is open i will go to the startup tab and here i will cautiously look for all unwanted applications so just look for all unwanted applications and just do a right click and disable so disabling from startup doesn't mean you will not be able to use those applications you will be able to use it it just whenever you will open the computer turn on the computer it will not automatically turn it on so just check one by one and make sure you do not disable your security or graphic card drivers now close the window third step which we need to click on the search and type power and here you need to click on power and sleep settings now at the top right corner you will find additional power settings here you will find choose your customize a power plan so at the right hand side you will find change plan settings so you can click change plan settings and here you will find change advanced power settings so once you click on that a new window will appear like so here guys you need to check high performance here so if you have high performance power server or even balance please make sure you select one of three so i will select high performance and then i will scroll it down and look for processor power management now here we need to click on this plus icon and here you will find minimum processor state so once you click on that it should be at the zero so if it's a different value make sure you just type zero and the system cooling policy should be active and the maximum processor state should be 100 once you have done that just click apply and ok right so once you do that restart the computer and let me know how exactly the difference i will see you in the next video have a wonderful day